everybody, welcome back to the channel. We have officially decided on the winner of the giveaway. A, few, a day or two later than what we, uh, what I expected to do this. I wanted to do it, but you know, it's real busy around Christmas and New Year's. So we, uh, now we have the official winner picked out. There are a lot of winners though. There's a lot of good stories, a lot of sad stories, unfortunately. Um, uh, but the one that stood out the most is the one that was picked and I think you'll enjoy it um, if you entered if you if you submitted a story of one of your Christmas story um, they got read and I appreciate all the entries uh, it was a little more than uh, I bit off a little more than I could chew because <laughs> it was like I don't read that often and I had literally I've read like a book since uh, with all those compiled but anyway did I already say anything Merry Christmas Happy New Year I can't remember. Anyway, did so I already say, say it again. Happy New Year. Merry Christmas. <laughs> yeah, yeah, because I said it's first day of 2022. There's a lot going on. We had a celebration last night. Not really a celebration. We don't really do New Year's. There's a mosquito flying around yes. in here. By the way, it's... How, 83 what, degrees. 83 degrees today at our house. Last year, this time, the temperature was below freezing because I sprayed our... Uh, we have a tree beside the house and I sprayed water into it and it had all the big, huge icicles. And um, the girls, or you brought it up, said that was that was yesterday or last year today. Mm -hmm. That was and that was yesterday, or was that today? I don't remember. I'm so confused. It was what in the year past few days. Yeah, ago. so it was it was New Year's a year yeah. ago. Anyway, but this I'm year gonna she's going to kill the mosquito. No, well, he disappeared. Um, 83 degrees. It's very humid. Yes. Um, anyway, we had a little celebration last night. I had a, my son-in-law loves to watch the Georgia Bulldogs. I've, I've been a Georgian most all my life. I could care less about football, but he loves it. So we said it in my, my uh, brother-in-law as well. They both are crazy mm -hmm. Georgia fanatics. But we set a television up and we ate oysters and had a good time, stayed up. They left it before midnight, but my girls made they sure. They left about 11, 15, but we still stayed up till late midnight. Yeah, I don't do the ball drop, but the girls did stay up. Ruthie and Ellie stayed up and watched the ball drop. And then as soon as it was done they Out. they went to bed okay so i hope you guys had a good new year's mm -hmm. hope that 2022 brings you whatever you want <laughs> i don't know whatever <laughs> yeah maybe not maybe i should retract that comment all right so anyway the winner is um we're gonna go and get to it um drum roll drum roll russell williams Russell has been a long time commenter on my channel, by the way, that has no, uh, re there's no reason why I picked Russell. That has no reason that, that did not influence it. Although Russell's been around a while, but Russell's story was the, yeah. the and was we, not the best. I'm not saying anyone's else was less, yeah. but, but it, it was, stood out to both of us because we read them separately and he came to me and was like, I know, I, I think I've got one. And then he started telling me and I was like, I remember reading that one too. And I thought it was really funny. <laughs> But I mean, they were all good. Just so I'm gonna let her. I don't have my. I've got my glasses, but I don't want to put them on to read. And I've already had them on a while ago, working on a model kit. And my eyes are out of adjustment, so she's gonna read it. Okay, right. Here's the story, Russell. I hope you don't mind we read it, yeah. but we're gonna read it. Well, I mean, he. Put it yeah, well, never mind. It's public. <laughs> what am I thinking? Uh, Merry Christmas, guys. There's a funny Christmas memory our family shares. Our house sits on a corner lot at one of the entrances to our subdivision. So we've always decorated big during the holidays. Our kids were about 12 and eight. This was in 1995, 96. When we decided to line our yard that December with luminaries in the little white sacks, sorry, in the little white sacks. At dusk, we got all the candles lit and it was beautiful. Then we got the great idea, let's make hot cocoa and jump in the van and go look at Christmas lights. We rode around about an hour and headed home. When we pulled up, our neighbor was in the driveway we all wondered where you guys were. The fire department just left. While we were gone, the wind picked up a little. One bag blew over, ignited, and about 60% of our corner lot was black. We were lucky. The neighbors saved our house by calling the fire department and getting the brush fire put out. We laugh about that dumb move every Christmas. Our kids were so embarrassed over that. <laughs> I thought that was pretty interesting, it Russell. Was. That, that was, was a good funny. one for you, you guys to... Uh drive off and didn't know you almost burnt your whole neighborhood down <laughs> it makes me think of like something that would happen on the the chevy chase 
Christmas. Yeah, you're right. Chevy Chase or Christmas Vacation yeah, or something like, like that. That seems like something that would be on that movie so, or something. Yeah, it does. <laughs> there are some others too. By the way, Russell, you just let me know which one of these you... You let me know which one of these you want and uh, it'll be in the mail just as soon as the mail starts running. They don't run today though. Tarn. So the Gremlin or the 69 Olds. Um, a, a few, there's a, so many stories and so many uh, stick out in my mind, but if I tried to remember them all, I would probably mix That's them enough. together. Um, there were some real, real good ones. One of them that stands out, and uh, it, it, I'll, I'll butch, butcher the, the story, but it was a military. You were in the military, you got out, and you didn't know your grandma had lived in a different house. You went to that neighborhood and uh, surprised everybody that wasn't your relatives at that house because you didn't know they had moved but anyway that was that was a funny one that that was really good and just so so many some people um i knew going into this that there would be uh some people that don't have such great christmas memories and that's really unfortunate and i'm sorry for that and uh you shared some you made the best of it i guess to say um you you have to make the best of what you're 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 given um sometimes that's difficult to do but um you made it through it and you, you're an adult and you can you have your own children and all your you know making your own your new stories so i knew coming into it that some of the stories would not be the greatest of memories and some people even don't like to think of those but anyway it was christmas time i wanted to do that and thank you russell and mm -hmm. so many, i didn't count them all but there was I don't, i'll rethink that one again before i because <laughs> I, I didn't think about all that reading that i had to do all right so um Again, Happy New Year. We want to do a live stream soon. I uh, kind of forgot about it. She says she didn't forget about it, but she didn't remind me as much as she needed to. I did remind him several times. But, but we, I, I want to start maybe doing a live stream, uh, maybe one or two with Heather. We're going to be in JaxCon, Jacksonville, Florida, JaxCon model show, and that is November, uh, February the 12th. I think it's the 11th is like a pre-registration and then the 12th. We'll definitely be there on the 12th. I don't know if we'll go down and stay in a hotel on the 11th or not. But anyway, I'll be there hopefully and Heather and the girls and um, we'll get to see some of you guys. I know there are going to be several of my YouTube friends that are going to be there and I, I look forward to seeing you guys. By the way, my son bought me this shirt for Christmas. What does it say? I'd rather be modeling. It's got model a Model building. Oh, model building. And it's got the cutters. I haven't got a clue what that is, but anyway, it's got a tank on it. It looks kind of like one of the little knives. Oh, that's what it is. It's a hobby knife. Okay. So I do have a tank right over there, so it does fit. And, and I have a couple more tanks and in the box. The, the and the camera that we're using, right? This GoPro that I had been looking at. I've got a really nice vlogging camera that I don't know how to work. And you guys have probably noticed that throughout the series we did <laughs> with Heather. The color was horrible. Anyway, he brought, bought me a GoPro for Christmas, so my son's name's Joseph, so thank you, Joseph, and um, that thing works like a charm. So, thank you guys for watching this video. I have a new build I've started on on this, well, actually it's in the incubator. I got some uh, putty on it drying, but I've got my 40 Ford build over here that you can't see that looks phenomenal. I'm so impressed with myself. That'll be coming out January the 15th that we're, we're doing a reveal, a re, re Reveal? Is that reveal. Right? Okay, reveal. I don't know. That sounded weird. There is a mosquito in yes, here. We're going to get that sucker. Us. So he comes back over here. He's getting a hat. So I'll have that video January the 15th. That's when we, all the YouTube content creator guys on Facebook, whatever channel Lucy see made up for us. We're going to reveal those. I'm going to have this build and, and going to try and get some more content out to you guys. It's been a little slow. I'm just curious. Have you yeah. ever explained to them about the incubator? Because someone has commented like incubator. Did you mean that? Yeah. Uh, so a hydrator or something like that. Yeah. Okay. So because when you say that, people are probably thinking. Well, yeah, that's, that's true. I think that. So if you just started watching this channel, hadn't watched some of my, pre my previous videos, and I had someone ask recently, "Do you really mean an incubator?" So when I take and paint my cars, it, rather than a lot of people use a dehydrator, I've just got an egg incubator that I removed the egg tilting function out of the center of it, and. Uh, <laughs> And so I turn it on, it gets like 100 degrees in there and it just it puts heat to your paint. So it's a real incubator. And I've showed, shown it on previous videos. You can go back and check that out. And one day I need to just do a, a video on some of the things I use. But yes, thank you for bringing that up. Um, anything else? Not that I know of. I'm gonna have to find her a new car to build or truck or something. The 
the 1984 Ford that she wanted to build for her parents is kind of like impossible to yeah. find something that year model. I don't know why they didn't build those trucks in, in a in a scale that we could build a model. But anyway, I'm just rambling. So you guys, I'm I'm glad for your uh, subscription. You guys, I have totally lost it here. Here, I know how to fix this. Let me have something to drink. Okay. Thank you for subscribing. This darn mosquito is I think what that's it is. Part of it. Yeah, it's very. <laughs> Just like so, he's gonna bite I, uh, us. I've got some problem where I'm so easily distracted that attention I'll, deficit disorder. Attention deficit disorder, possibly. <laughs> I don't know. Too much coffee. What was I saying? Dang, I don't forgot what I was subscribe. gonna say. Oh yeah, thank you guys for your you that have subscribed. Um, if you have not subscribed, uh, go over there and hit the subscription button. I promise I won't charge you a dime. Um, go to the Facebook group, uh, Model Car Videos Facebook group, and uh, join over there. That's a we have a great time. Over 2,000 members now, so we're growing. Um, don't forget to go to Hobby Nut Models, who supports me. Uh, check out Mark's inventory over at Hobby Nut Models, MCW Paint, supplies to build your kits, as well as a vast number of kits that you can choose from. Go over there to Hobby Nut Models and check that out. And one last thing, go to the Teespring store if you haven't already, and check out the inventory over there. You can get you a T-shirt. Um, and a hoodie or a cup or something like that. But anyway, I'm just rambling again. Thank you guys for your support. Again, Happy New Year, and we will see you on the next video, unless you have something else you have to say. Nope. You're done? I'm done. All right. Bye, guys. Bye. <laughs>